put some of that in there. And the whole point of this, right, is the whole explosion in the mouth. Welcome to Bard the Bay and I'm over at Mina Bazaar. Behind me is Wedge World and this is your official video review. Guys, welcome to Bardo Bay Mina Bazaar. I'm in the heart of it. I'm gonna take this off before we eat. Right, Wedge World. I've come to this this place specialises in Indian street food. I've been here before. Really, really authentic street food, as you would have in India from the street vendors. I can't wait to try their food. They've got such a massive selection. Great value for money. Right, I think it's time to order. Let's go. Guys, I'm out trying to discover new food places. Do not forget to hit the like, subscribe, and the bell icon. Here comes the rest of your video. So, we're going for the Dulux Tali. Tali is basically a plate. That's what it means. It has all sorts of different vegetable options, like it'll have lentils on there, it'll have uh, chapatis on there. Then we've gone for a Vada Pal, which is a a traditional Indian street food. It's like it's it's like a what, potato burger. That's in in a nutshell. Then we've gone for day batata puri, which is which is Indian. It's uh, the, the people know it as golgappe. It's the little fat things that go in your mouth in this explosion. Uh, then we've gone for a bhaji pao or a pao bhaji, which is like a tomato and potato puree served with a uh, burger with like a like a toasted burger and then we've gone uh, for a samosa chart because charts are massive in India right when you go any street vendor they give you a plate people just standing on the roadside eating charts without further ado I think it's time to eat right, first off is this have a look at this this is called the Dei Batata Puri around these parts of the world also known as Golgappa Dei Puri right. it's like a pocket of street food right there right there we go mm. the coriander the crunch the softness of the potatoes, the chickpeas, the green tamarind sauce. Oh wow. Let me put some of this in there. This. Put some of that in there. And the whole point of this, right, is the whole explosion in the mouth. Mm. This place specializes in strictly vegetarian option. If you're a meat eater, probably not one for you. I'm a meat eater, but this vegetarian option here is so nice. I must do when in Dubai. Right, this is the Julep Tali. Let me show you the, the roti first. Look at this. Then you got the vegetarian options. Let's see what this is first of all. This is the dal. Oh, look at that. Lentils. Oh yeah. Go away. It's so so nice. Look at this. This is another dal. Thicker than the first one. Oh. Mmm. So much going on there. I can feel. I can see. I can taste sweet corn in there as well. Oh. And then this. This is another dal, 
but this time it's got paneer in there. Look at that. The panini is so soft. It's totally such a brilliant option. You get the best of everything. So, let me show you something else before I move on to something else. Look at this. This is the pickle achar. It's something about achar, the roti, and then the dal. Let's do it properly, Indian style. Right, moving on to this bad boy over here, the vada ball. Look at that. It's a spicy potato filling in a bun. And they've even given me a few chilies in case it wasn't spicy enough. So I bite of this monster. Mm. It's got crispy outer with a soft dinner. But it's got a it's got a chili kick to it. You see how spicy the chilies are? That's spicy. Mm. Onions green chutney i need a kick from this i need a crunchiness of the samosa a crunchiness of the onions if they got this right let's have a look now they mm. look at that a lot of people think they can make samosa job but this is how you do it properly what can i say That is a beautiful smosa chart. It's so much full of flavour. It's chilli but it's not no it's not an overkill. While I was eating this, you can imagine standing on the side of a street in India as the traffic goes past you and you eat this, right? This is what Veg World does. It's really brought the Indian street food to the heart of Dubai. Let's move on. It's a normal traditional bun, soaked a little bit into a little bit of oil and toasted a little bit. And then you have this puree made from chilies, tomatoes, and potato. Sprinkled on the very last minute with this desi ghee. Right. Look at that. They make it a little bit more interesting. Onions, sprinkle of lime. If there wasn't enough going on already, right? Let's do this. Mm. The lime just brings everything out. Great use of coriander there. Oh wow. It's quite traditional around here, right? In Mina Bazaar. Any shop you go into, they'll offer you a tea. More than likely, it's come from this place, from Wedge World. As you can see, the lady is pouring in the tea for us right now. No problem. You come outside, grab yourself a tea, walk, admire the, the scenery and the shops, and drink your tea. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. Right, Kodak tea, Mina Bazaar, Veg World. Let me try it first of all and see if it is really Kodak tea. Oh, yeah, check that out. There you have it, that's been Veg World. Let's talk prices first of all. Everything we've eaten, we're probably talking five quid, three quid, four quid, just like that. 
you know, nothing to break the bank. It's such authentic food in the middle of Dubai. And then you've got these really good affordable prices. There's family sitting out there. There's local people that are sitting out there, people that work in Dubai for a good reason. Because the food is very, very authentic. It's very close to what would be served in India on a daily basis. And that's the reason and it's pure pure vegetarian so if you if, if you're a meat eater you can still eat it if you're vegetarian you can still eat it and really enjoy yourself so i have really enjoyed myself over at wedge world these guys are always very very polite they've got plenty of seating right the address details are going to be in the comment section so check these guys out if you're in dubai these guys are scoring this you're watching imran and gary are watching the beta reviews yeah.